please, let me do the dishes. That's the least I can do. I'm crashing here. Crashers clean dishes. Your family. Besides, if they're not clean the right way, David becomes a big baby about it all. I'm a pro at this point. No, no, no. I insist. Grab this sponge and you're going to be eating it too. It's not a big deal. I've got it. Nah, I know you don't mind, but I, I won't be here for too long. Just, you know, gotta get back on my feet a little. You're right. I don't mind. But David does. Is that it? Maybe a little bit. No, actually, forget I said that. Uh, that wasn't for me to... Just forget it. Sorry. He's always talking about how I'm never around, and then when I'm actually here, he acts like he doesn't know me. It's complicated. But look, he loves you. You're his brother. He's got an odd way of showing it. So where do you think you'll go? Don't know. With what happened, I'd be amazed if I could get a job assistant coaching T-ball. You'll land on your feet. Well, here's hoping. I could use a fresh start. Uh, I'll, I'll probably just travel around, you know, see what's out there. Want to take me with you? Well? Uh, sure. Just finish up with those dishes and I'll bring the car around. <laughs> but I pick the music. <laughs> yeah, never mind then. You know I'm just messing around, but it's hard to say no to a fresh start. I always wanted to go to Norway, see the northern lights. But you'll be jet-setting and I'll still just be here. Oh, oh god damn it. Oh Ooh, shit. Quick shit, run shit, underwater. Shit. Well, that was David's army glass. Oh, he's gonna be so pissy about it. I can hear him already. Oh, it's so annoying. He should be more worried about you slicing your hand open. He should be. There you go. See? Much better. What was that noise? Guys! You're... You're gonna be okay. Hello? My CEO gave me that. And unless you want to dig up his fucking corpse, he's not gonna give me another well, why one. Why don't we get an actual dishwasher? Oh. Here we go again. Then you won't be on my ass anytime there's a spot on a fork. Excuse me? If we could even afford a dishwasher. It is just a glass. It was important to me, Javi. A glass? We don't see your ass for a year. A year. Then when your life goes to shit, we're expected to drop everything and roll out the red carpet. All for Prince Javi. And now you're gonna start telling me how to talk to my wife? This isn't about him. Really? He's the one standing right there, judging me for something he doesn't understand. You don't know him like I do. Always judging everyone, except himself. You know what, David? Time for you to open your eyes. Kate's gonna leave your ass. What? She told Honey! me so. You said that? Jesus fucking Christ, no! We were talking about traveling and I just... No, I definitely didn't say that. At all. Three days, then I want you off my couch and out the door. We clear? Fine. Javi, that is my husband. We are married, in case you forgot. That's for life. Hey, take it easy. What happened? They got away. Oh god. Mariana.
I already dug a grave for her. Thank you. This was my fault, Mariana. God. God damn it. I'm so sorry, honey. Javi, thank you for staying. I think you probably saved my life. I should have gone with them. No, we fought. We slowed them down. And now they'll come back for us, right? I... I don't know. Maybe. Hey, hang on a sec. She carried this around for years. I'm sorry I never found you those candy bars. You deserved just so much more life. You should have been the one burying me. Except someday. Someday far away. You did everything you possibly... The other guys had this too. Oh, shit. What? Well, what's wrong? Clem? I've run into these guys before. Who are they? Please. They call themselves the New Frontier. They used to be decent people. Now they're something else. This brand they have. It's like an initiation thing. I was kind of stuck in their camp for a while. Not by choice. It was bad. I'm lucky to be alive. Bad how? I got out. That's all that matters. They left one of their cars behind. That's something at least. Good. Just like you always wanted. I can take you back to Prescott, make sure your family's okay. But then I'm hitting the road. You should stay with us. Let's just get back to Prescott.
You're back. How's Kate? Uh, she... Just came out of surgery. Eleanor's still with her. You'd best get over to the infirmary. He made it back. She asked for you. You know. Please, please just tell me how she's doing. Well, she came through the surgery as well as could be expected. Those bastards did her one favor at least. Any lower, and that bullet would have torn her stomach lining as well. Your boy Gabe. He seems really fierce. He wanted to help so badly. He practically forced me to let him stay. That's Gabe. But she was bleeding so much he... got overwhelmed. So when's she gonna be up on her feet again? She's stable. For now. But she's still bleeding inside. I don't wanna lie to you. It's probably just a matter of time. I... I wish I could do more. Thanks for trying. And for not sugarcoating it. Wish I had something better to tell you. But I'm sorry, Javi. I'm going to get cleaned up. You may want to find Gabe. He looked pretty upset when he left. This isn't going to make him feel any better. Still. I'll track him down. I know Trip drove like hell to get Kate back here. Flew in a plane just like this to a baseball game in Arkansas once. Lifetime ago. Hey, have you seen a kid come through here? Blood all over his hands. Dark look on his face. Headed off that way, without saying a word. If I were you, I'd give him some space. Just my advice. One parent to another. I wish I could, but, uh, I don't think I can. Okay. But he sure didn't seem like he was in the mood to talk. That blood, I take it that wasn't his? His stepmom's. You gotta stay strong for her. Do whatever it takes. Know if my friends seen one in the same situation, I'd fight like hell. Anything we can do to help you out, just let me know. I, uh... Appreciate that. Your boy stomped off towards the front gate. How's she doing? Not great. As well as can be expected, and yeah, considering. You should have come back with us. Your family, they needed you. Clementine needed my help back there. She could take care of herself. Your family, they were the ones who needed help. It's a hell of a situation. Just know I'm praying for you, all of you. And whatever happens, you all are welcome to stick around in Prescott, if that's what you want. Nobody's gonna force you, but we'd be glad to have you all here. Not gonna make a decision like that without talking to Kate, so... I'd rather check in with her when she's feeling better, you know? Sure thing. Let the lady weigh in first. Hmm. 
Doesn't look super sturdy. Go back and bury Mariana. We buried her. It was peaceful. How could it have been peaceful? I know how much you miss her, Gabe. I miss her too. And Kate, she needed me during her surgery. She needed my help. I just ran away like a stupid little kid. You're right. You should have stayed. Kate needed you back there. I needed you back there. I know, I just... I just lost it. That's not an excuse. Not anymore. I'm done feeling this way. Feeling powerless. I can't be some helpless little boy anymore. I need to be a man. Just like my dad was. He knew how men were supposed to act. You're already a man, Gabe. I'm not. But at least I know it now. Next time, I'm not gonna sit back and watch. I'm gonna do something. I have to. Listen, Gabe. Shit. Get inside! Now! We might have to leave. Make sure Kate's ready. You can count on me. I thought you kicked her ass out. Knock, knock! Anyone home? He was one of the men at the junkyard. These are those freaks that brand themselves. I wish we hadn't had to come all the way out here, but unfortunately, Badger here says you attacked his man. He says you fired on him. Took out a lot of our people. They shot first. They killed my niece. Shot a woman in cold blood. How many of my friends died because of you, huh? Sounds like a bunch of he said, she said shit to me. Well, what the fuck do you want? An apology? What I really want is for my dead buddies to be alive again. But I don't think that's too likely, is it? He needs to come with us. Answer to justice. Accept his punishment. Men have got to have laws. Otherwise, we're no better than the animals. Or else what? What are you gonna do? You know damn well what. Fact of the matter is, you stole from us. You killed some of us. Give it up now and get down here. I think they need a little incentive. You had a hostage. It's gonna be okay, baby. I love you, I'm baby. All right, baby. Just, just give them what they want. There's no reason this has to get ugly. But we ain't leaving without what we came for. You hurt her, and I'll hurt you back worse than you could ever imagine. Big words. The words are just that. Where is he? Oh my god! Now get your ass down oh here! God. Or I please. cut off the rest of them! What the hell are you doing? Hobby, please, man. Just just go with him. You got to. He'll kill Francine! Nobody's giving in to them. We should start shooting. No fucking way! He'll kill Francine! He might kill her anyway, Conrad. 
We gotta risk it. No, uh-uh, no way. We do not open fire while she's down there. It's cool. I'm coming out. I'm all yours. <sighs> Thank you. I don't know, man. Me neither. Good man. Let's lock him in the truck and get the hell out of here. I don't want to wait that long. Jesus Christ. Come on. I want to see him pay for what he did. We got what we came for, Badger. We had a deal. You asked for me to come down, and I did. Yeah? Well, fuck the deal. Ah! The fuck? Christy! Oh, what the fuck? We don't have the go ahead! No, fuck you! Fuck the go ahead! Ram the fucking gate! Jesus Christ! Are they following us? Not just the other car. 
Looks like we're okay. Eleanor! Thank God. I can't believe it. All of our friends, all those people. Oh, Conrad. I'm sorry, Conrad. You're sorry? You're sorry? You're the reason they came to Prescott in the first place. She's there because of you. Conrad? Easy, buddy. This wasn't his fault. Bullshit. Francine, Prescott, all because this washed-up cheat walked through our gates. I should have known it the second I looked at you. You ain't gonna stand up for nobody but your own. We... We just lost someone, too. So... Say what you have to say. What? That's supposed to make me feel better? Calm down, Conrad. Please. All I know is, if it wasn't for him... Back the fuck off! Now! Just back away! Take it easy, son. Gabriel! Put it away! Now! He's gonna hurt you! No way! Just do it already. I don't even care anymore. Just put it down, Gabe. Come on, kid. Gabe, don't make me repeat myself. Don't touch my uncle again. Fuck me. Gabe! Let him go. He just needs to cool off. <laughs> we have to go back. We have to bury her. I wish we could, but... Prescott's overrun. We can't go back. Well, we're not safe here either. What about Richmond? I've heard there's a community there. If it's true, they'll have food, walls, maybe even a hospital. All I want is to find the motherfuckers who did this. They took my home. They took my... God damn it! You want revenge? You're gonna need help. Maybe going to Richmond is the way to get it. Richmond? Huh. It's something, at least. <sighs> yeah. Fuck it. Let's go. That's a spirit, man. Hey, Gabe. Oh. Hey. You okay? Huh. Maybe they'll hit it off. Yeah. You know, that was really Hope so. Might be good for them both. They need someone their own age they can talk to. Come on, guys. We got a long drive ahead of us. isn't good. How's her forehead feel? Uh, hot. Hot. Fuck. It's probably sepsis. Sooner we get to Richmond, the better. Oh, oh god damn it. Oh, it really hurts. <laughs> hey, you're gonna be fine, Kate. Uh, I'm just trying to be realistic. Yeah, well, I'm trying to be optimistic. Javi, we both know what's coming. Kane. We do. And this is gonna sound fucked up, but maybe this is my chance for... Christ, I don't know. 
know. <laughs> Graceful exit. <laughs> Not many people get those. I'd be one of the lucky ones. <laughs> you can't talk that way. Hey, <laughs> it's my deathbed. Just think about all that's happened. <laughs> Mariana died. I couldn't stop it. And Gabe, I heard what happened when we stopped. Isn't it obvious? Look, he might be turning into David. He might be turning into you. He's not that sweet little boy I first met. He just needs guidance. And a lot of it. And I hope so. All I care about is him becoming who he needs to be. And it's gonna be on you to make sure that happens. No. It's on him. He's not gonna take my advice anymore. That doesn't mean he doesn't need you. Oh! Hey! Careful! Sorry! You should get some rest, Kate. We all should. Really. With pleasure. Ugh. Parents just love pretending the rest of us can't hear. I wouldn't know. Great. What now? I've got some bad news. So what's going on? Well, we got a bunch of cars clogging the underpass. Too many to drive through. We're gonna need to move some of them out of the way. <sighs> hey, I'm coming too. I'll stay with Kate and keep a lookout. Yell at us if anything happens. Awfully convenient the pass is blocked like this. Not convenient at all, if you ask me. If we move that car right there, we should be good. Come on, let's get to work and clear it out.
atop the hood. You'd better not mess up my baby here. That'll do. Here goes nothing. Hey! There we go! I think we're set. We good? Be ready to move once the wreck is clear. We should be right behind you. Will do. Get the walkers! I knew this place didn't feel right. What the hell are we gonna do now? We have to come up with some kind of plan. Oh, what a great idea. A plan. Who would have thought of that? We don't have a choice. We gotta fight our way out. I'm not so I like our odds. Great. This is just fucking great. What the hell are we gonna do? Calm down. Calm down? I'm not gonna fucking calm down. Eleanor's out there alone right now. We wouldn't even be in this mess if it wasn't for you. That's not true. Fuck you, Conrad. Whoa, 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 stop! There's somebody over there. What? Where? Shit. I see Everybody get down! Wait, was this all a trap? Show yourself!
I'm gonna need you to turn around for me. Slowly. Did you hear me? The hell? That thing's not a toy. Drop it, or you might hurt yourself. Now then, I'm not gonna shoot. Not unless you make me. I just want to talk. You got me? Just want to have a word. So talk. Okay then. You, the two guys there, the kids, the women in the car, I saw you split up. I overheard that little argument just now. Your friends over there aren't gonna shoot me, right? You folks have your shit together? If you're some kind of broken tribe, then let me know now. They're good people. They've lost a lot. Sure. We all have. Recently. Ah, fresh wounds. That makes sense. You're going to Richmond. That tells me you got something to do with what's going on down there. Question is, whose side are you on? Look, man, I don't know what you're... Don't move. Well, you see one of them? Hey, man, what do you mean by them? Who's them? You know what I'm talking about. The New Frontier. What? No, I'm not with those guys. You got this backwards. Avi, this guy's full of donkey shit. Do you want to let me talk? I don't think he's with those guys. Look, I'm telling you. I'm on my way to Richmond, just like you. I lost touch with some good people there when the New Frontier took over. What did you say? The New Frontier? They took over Richmond? Don't tell me you didn't know that. Fuck. Oh, God. Eleanor and Kate. They're headed right to the middle of those assholes. At least now we got an excuse to go after those motherfuckers. What are we gonna do? Everyone, just calm down. Calm down? Calm down! How the hell do you want us to be calm about this? They're gonna fucking kill us! Not if we get to them first. There's an old train tunnel that runs under the James River. From what I hear, it should be a straight shot into Richmond. A train tunnel. I could lead you guys there. But since uh, a hobby here said you're good people and all, maybe you could lower those guns first. Lower than my ass? We're gonna tie you up and make sure your story checks out. That's really not necessary. I don't know. We just met this guy. We all just met. Lower your guns. Javi, man, don't... Do you trust me or not? Thank you. Ready? This way. Hey. What do we call you? Sorry, forgot to introduce myself. It's Paul, but my friends call me Jesus. Okay.
Come on. some dinner. Hopefully find us some dinner. Keep that thing pointed at me if it makes you feel better, but if you shoot me, you'll have to deal with all of them. Pretty big group of them out there. But it'll pass. Eventually. Stay right where you are. Don't move. Don't worry, Kill. I'm not going anywhere. I'd say we make a pretty good team. The two of us. Well, the three of us, I mean. Thanks, I guess. No problem, kiddo. Anytime you need an oversized doorstop, you know who to call. He's a cute kid. You guys living here? You seem kind of young to be a mom. What are you, 13? Damn, you're a child yourself. His real parents are gone. I'm all he has. Then he's cute and lucky. He has someone looking after him. Not much of that anymore. We were out there scouting. Nothing out of the ordinary, and then... Ordinary, and then... Chaos, and... Shit, those bastards are slow, but God damn it, when there's enough of them. I got separated from the others. I hope they all made it. I thought we were ready for anything. But they were all around us before we saw them. What were you scouting for? Gas? Water? Any supplies we could find, really. Sure as hell wasn't worth it. My people are probably at the rendezvous by now. What's left of them, at least. By the way, I'm Ava. And my group? We call ourselves the New Frontier. He's hungry. Hey, why don't you come with me? Meet my people. We have food, blankets, bottled water. Come on, dinner's on me. Groups aren't really my thing. No woman is an island. Have it your way. But you did me a solid here. I won't forget it next time we cross paths. There is no next time. We'll see. The world does work in mysterious ways. These tunnels were abandoned decades ago. But I've heard you can get through. Here's hoping. Javi, I need to talk to you. About? Look, I appreciate you keeping quiet about me in the New Frontier. But what I told you earlier, it's not the whole truth. I wasn't their prisoner. I was... I was one of them. I should have told you sooner. I... I really should have. Oh my god! You let them brand you? Just listen. 
I'm not asking you to forgive me, but you have to understand. I had nobody. I was all alone, and I thought I didn't need them, but they were very persuasive. mistake, and so was not telling you about it. Tell me you're not still one of them. No way. Believe me. Hear that? Coming from over there. Can you see anything? <laughs> They're everywhere! Fuck! They are. Keep sharp. Watch out! Just go through. Well, does it open? I got it. Come on. Daylight's ahead. Thank fucking God. Let's go. We can't have those walkers following us. Javi and I will block the door. You guys go ahead and make sure it's clear. Make it fast. We'll be right ahead up. He's staying here. Hold the door shut until I can find something to barricade it with. Hurry! Oh my God. Ah, shit! I'm gonna have to break this thing off. Hurry, they're almost here. Javi! I can't... There's too many! Help! Watch that through! Now! Okay, let's go. We gotta... Wow. I wouldn't touch that gun, girl. You either, cowboy. What the hell are you doing? I heard you too. You think I'm stupid? Finish your little story. Now. We... we need to keep moving. No, you need to talk. Put the gun down, Conrad. Not until she rolls up her sleeve. <clears throat> what? Why? I fucking knew it. You're one of them? You're goddamn right she is. What other bullshit did you shove down our throats, huh? I'm <laughs> fucking believable. Jesus! Conrad, lower the fucking gun. This isn't necessary. Lower it? You're missing the bigger picture, son. Don't you see? We bring her to Richmond. They'll give us whatever we want. Medical help for Kate. She's our bargaining chip. They won't bargain with you. You don't know them. Won't know until we try. She's not a bargaining chip. She's a friend. Oh. I'm sure after less than a day, you two are just soulmates. How's that for an answer? Go to hell, Conrad. I'm not doing this. If you want to shoot me, shoot me. How about I shoot your little boyfriend here instead? Then don't let her walk through that door. Crazy. Shoot Nobody him. has to shoot anybody. Just tell Clem this is how it's got to be. And then we all step into the sunshine. Come on, man. Be reasonable. This helps both of us. I'm just gonna go. Don't take another step. Javi, please. I'm 
sorry, Clem. But you said... I know what I said. It's not worth Gabe's life. Come on, Clem. Start walking. You're a fucking coward! A fucking coward! Javi, how? How could you? I did this for Kate. For us. But what about Clem? What about Clem? She's not family. Think whatever you want. We're going. If you really want Clem to live, do this my way. Why the hell has he got a gun on Clementine? You want to tell him or should I? Out with it! Why is there a weapon in that girl's back? No reason. He's overreacting is all. Like hell I am. If you just take a deep breath here, she's New Frontier. Has been all along. They're gonna be real happy to see her again. I put money on it. He's not wrong. This could be useful. But right now, we need to find Kate and Eleanor. You're right. Let's move out. The gates are this way. If your people are here, that's where they would have ended up. Why is it so quiet? Thought there'd be New Frontier marching in the streets and shit. Practicing on walkers, or... Whatever the fuck they do. It does seem strangely quiet. Maybe we just got lucky. Trust me, they're out there. Javi, what are they doing? That's their car! Hey, keep it down. Kate? Kate, can you hear me? Kate, talk to me. Say something. Javi? Yes? I'd really use something to take the edge off right about now. Oh, Jesus Christ. You scared the hell out of me. Kate! Are you... Are you okay? Come here. Where's Eleanor? She... She went ahead to get help. She hasn't come back. Must have got her. Jesus, how far is it to their compound? Not too much farther now. A couple blocks at most. Gabe, help me lift her up. <laughs> I'm thinking Kate's not going to make it much longer. So it's time we walk up to their front door and say hello. That mean we're doing this my way? It might. But so we're clear. You follow my lead until our people are safe. Understood? Fine. Here we go. There it is. New Richmond. This is a mistake. Just shut up and keep walking. We're here, Kate. I'm gonna get you inside, okay? Javi? If they can save me... How about you and me finally take that trip to Norway? 
the northern lights. Remember? Sky lit up all green and purple. First, we get inside and get you to a doctor, okay? Jesus, there's a solid possibility this isn't gonna go our way. If you want to stay behind, I wouldn't blame you. Hey, this is where I was going in the first place. Hey! You again? You must have some kind of death wish. She needs medical help. And you have one of our people. Uh-huh. What's your point? Sorry about this, Clem. Clementine! How long's it been? Not long enough. Cute. She's got you mixed up in all this. Who is she to you? Doesn't look like she's here by choice, so... By force? She's our friend. Which means what we're doing right now doesn't sit real well with me. But if we can't get inside those gates, Kate will die. All right. You have my attention. But I'd be lying if I said I was convinced. What do you want to do? Go get the boss. He's gonna want to see this. Now all of you, lower your weapons. Not a chance! Might be a good idea to play along here, at least for now. You put him down, I'll see that as an expression of good faith. Nice and easy. Or else this is gonna end bad. I don't think so. We lower our weapons, we're dead. Guess we're doing this the hard way then. What the hell's going on out here? They didn't drop their weapons. I didn't have a choice or they would have... Oh my god. Oh. Dad? What? Oh. Holy shit. Previously on The Walking Dead. You don't have to fill his cup up anymore, baby. Grandpa is sleeping. No, Yaya. Tipo's awake. Solamente está confundido. Mama. Oh my god! Oh my god! <laughs> Hands up and close your eyes. Thanks. Mari! Oh, shit! Kate! Oh. 
Javi, don't! Hey, what do we call you? Sorry, forgot to introduce myself. It's Paul, but my friends call me Jesus. I fucking knew it. You're one of them? You're goddamn right she is. If you want to shoot me, shoot me. How about I shoot your little boyfriend here instead? I'm sorry, Glenn. What the hell's going on out here? Oh my god. Just gonna get that propane and then come right back. I, I saw it in that pickup truck parked down the road a little, in front of the Wallace's house. I just wish there was an easier way to get it, and that we didn't have to risk life and limb every damn day. Nothing's easy anymore, Kate. But that doesn't mean we don't have to try. <sighs> I know. It's just hard to get used to, that's all. We get over there, we grab the tank, and we get the hell back home. If we're lucky, we won't see a single one of those things. Fingers crossed. There it is! Let's take it and go. Why would we get that lucky? Hey, 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 don't beat yourself up about it. It was worth a shot. It just didn't work out. I'm sorry. I'm just sick of this shit. I just thought this one time we deserve to catch a fucking break. friends. True. He was so sweet. He always had a smile on his face. Cape worshipped him. That's not Drew anymore. I know it, it still looks like him, but the kid you knew, he's gone. All that's left is this thing. I don't even know what to call them. If they're not people, if they're just the dead. <sighs> Muertos. That's what we'll call them. I thought we were gonna die. I thought Gabe and Mariana were just gonna wake up and we would just be gone. I'm right here, okay? I'm here. You're here. We're still alive. That's what matters. <sighs> Can we go back now?
I know we all wanted to stay here in the house and wait for David to come back. But it's been three months since he drove away with your mom. What are you saying? We're not safe here. Not anymore. You and I could have been killed out there. For an empty can. There's gotta be a safer place out there. But Kate, I mean, this is your home. You're getting sentimental now? We stay. Somebody's going to get hurt. Or worse. You really think the kids are going to be happy with this plan? The kids will understand. A and if they don't, we'll just make them see it our way. We have to go. How come? What if I don't want to leave? Cape. We're safe inside the house. A and I bet we can find more food in the neighborhood if we just look harder. We're tired of being afraid every time we leave you guys alone. And it's just getting worse out there. Better to leave now. While we still can. But what about Dad? What's he gonna think if he shows up and we, we just ditched him? We might never find him again. We have to look out for ourselves now, Gabe. I wish things were different, but our safety's more important. But we're safe here. No, we're not. I'm sorry, Gabe, but Javi's right. Uh, how about... You guys go and I stay here. You're a kid. That's not how it works. I can take care of myself. If I need any help, I'll just ask my friends. Gabe? Honey? What? What's, what's wrong with her? Why is she acting so weird? Uncle Javi? She's sad. Because when we were out, we saw your friend, Drew. But it wasn't exactly him anymore. You mean... He, he was one of them? We're so sorry, Gabe. So you understand why, don't you? Why we have to leave? If that happened to you, I couldn't bear it. When do we have to go? Tomorrow, as soon as it's daylight. I want to leave him a note. I'll help you get started, okay? What are we going to tell him? I want to say something good. Something that won't make him sad. Just tell him we love him, all of us. And nothing's going to change that, not ever. I like that. I'm gonna write it right now, so we don't forget. Of course. I'll help him. Thank you. Really.
Dad? Javi! Is that really you? <laughs> I always hoped I'd find you. God, you have no idea how good it is to see your face. I think I got a pretty decent idea, actually. I knew you were still alive. I knew it! Hey, weapons down! This is my family! You gotta let us in. Kate doesn't have much longer. Jesus. Kate! David? I'm here, honey. I'm right here. What the hell happened? She's been shot. And we got the bullet out, but she's still bleeding. We need your doctor. Now, David. Thanks, Javi. For getting her here. She's coming inside! But she hasn't been checked! This is my wife, Max. You want her to die? No! I didn't say that! Our doctor's gonna help you, honey. I'm gonna make sure of it. Wait, I I'm going with you. Sorry, but the rest of you have to go straight to quarantine. What for? All newcomers get checked for bites, and they all have to answer a couple of questions. Our doctor will clear the two of them, but the rest of you have to come with me to the quarantine holding area. Don't you get it? I'm David's brother. I'm going to the hospital with them. We have procedures here. Procedures that have to be followed. Even if you are related to David. Ah, this is bullshit. Come on. The sooner you come along, the sooner we can get you cleared. I'll be there as soon as I can! Oh, Let's man. go! Without you in it, I didn't know what to think. The engine up and died. I came here looking for help, and this what happened. Is? I've been so worried about Kate. I told them she needed a doctor. They promised me someone would look into it. Please, tell me they found her. Well, luckily we found her before she got any worse. They just took her to the hospital. I can't believe no one went to look for her. I'm sorry, Javi. Really, but I didn't have any reason not to believe them. What? The people here in Richmond. Their new frontier. Oh my god. Oh, ho, ho, you ain't even heard the worst part yet. One of them's his brother. I didn't even know you had a brother, Javi. Hey, nobody's more surprised than me. I, I thought the guy was dead. We haven't seen David in years. It's just been me, Kate, and the kids this whole time. I don't even want to think about what the odds are, but he did seem pretty damn surprised to see you. Whoever this guy is, he can't be all bad, right? I mean, he helped Kate instead of hauling her down here. Of course he brought her inside. She's his damn wife. You're kidding. Kate is married to your brother? The way you two acted around each other. I just didn't think she had a husband out there, is all. The only reason I know Kate is because she married David. I was the best man at their wedding. Wow. Okay. Family drama aside, hope you know I'm not about to make nice with New Frontier. I know you didn't have much stake in Prescott, Javi, but they burned that place to the ground for no fucking reason. After everything you folks told me, I'm guessing I'm not gonna find my people alive. Hell, Javi. They killed your niece! Shot Kate! For all we know, your brother could have been behind it. And even if it wasn't his idea in the first place, if he knew about it and didn't stop it... I hate to admit it. There's a chance he gave the order. If he didn't know it was them, if he was just trying to get payback for what was stolen... It's 
possible. Clementine, you were part of the New Frontier. Did you know David? I knew him. If I'm being honest, he's not a good guy. Is that right? If you told me he was the one behind Prescott, I wouldn't be surprised. I'm the first to admit my brother can be kind of a hard ass, but he's not that bad. People change. What happened at the gates? The fact that he's your brother? That doesn't change anything. I'm gonna find the man who killed Francine. These people better not get in my way. I'm gonna be asking questions about what went down at Prescott. And I won't stop until I get answers. We can't just go charging into someone else's house and tell them what's what. You're saying, after everything that went down at Prescott... You all need to get in line. You're not in charge here. Not yet, maybe. You do anything to fuck this up, Kate could end up getting hurt. Hey. Hey. I would have been here sooner, but I had to take care of... something. Come on already, Kate's asking for you. Maybe you think it's okay to keep a lady waiting. What about the rest of my friends? They're not invited. Hurry up now. Looks like the rules don't apply to everyone, huh? That's right. Some people get out of here early. Others stay a long fucking time. Trip, just drop it, okay? Smart cookie, this one. Javi, just go. I'll be back as soon as I can. You know that. Thanks. I heard you tell your friends to get in line. We have a process. Our own way of doing things. Your guys better not have a problem with that. Things don't go well for troublemakers here. I hope that's clear. No problem. You won't have to worry about them. Didn't sound that way. They just need time to get used to things. I hope you're right. Come on. Where are we going? Kate asked for you. I thought you'd want to check on her. Listen, Javi, Gabe... He told me some pretty messed up things. Things I need your help wrapping my head around. He shouldn't have done that. I wanted to tell you myself. Bad news is bad news. Who cares who delivers it? He told me you lost Mariana. Just a few days ago. Oh. I'm sorry, David. She's... She's gone. It's strange grieving for the same person twice. Like losing something you didn't know you had. What was she like, Javi? She was so little when we got separated. Who did my little girl become? We got along well. Her smile kept me going through a lot of rough times. That... must have been nice. How... How did she die? Tell me how it happened. Please, I need to know. She was just standing there, minding her own business. She just found her lost headphones in the dirt. She was smiling. And then someone put a bullet in her head. 
What kind of animal would just open fire on her like that? An animal with your mark. My people aren't in the habit of killing little girls. David, I was there. They shot Kate, too. Ask your buddy at the gate if you don't believe me. Max was a part of this? Fuck. I need details. What the hell went down out there? I need to know exactly what happened. Everything you remember. Same assholes killed a hostage. A at this town, Prescott. Prescott? At the airstrip? Their leader flooded it with walkers and, and tear gas. Leader? A crazy bald guy with a beard. Badger? What the fuck have you done now? I'm gonna handle that stupid son of a bitch, okay? Do me a favor, keep this to yourself. The politics here, they can get messy. I thought you were the boss. There's four of us that run, Richmond. You need to impress the other three. Or you'll be back on the road by morning. Try not to stir things up. You and your friends could have a very short stay. You wouldn't let that happen, would you? We only just got here. It's not just up to me. I run security here, but it's not like my word is law. This shit with Badger doesn't make things any easier. Who's the fresh meat? Ava is my brother, Javi. The baseball brother? <sighs> No shit. What are the chances of you turning up on the doorstep? Welcome to civilization. It's a pleasure to meet you, Ava. Oh, is it now? You didn't say he was a gentleman, David. That's because he's not. Ava's my right hand. If there's anyone you can trust in Richmond, it's her. woman, the fucking soldier. She was the first person I met up with after you and me got separated. I never would have made it without her. Gabe said you went back to the house. At the start. I'm sorry I never found you. We waited for you. For three months. Eventually, the house was overrun and we had to move. Why didn't you come back? Mama and I got routed out of the city on the way to the hospital. It wasn't long before she... Poor Mama. I couldn't get back into Baltimore, so I hooked up with my old unit. We thought we could build a safe zone outside D.C. After what happened to Mama and everyone else, I thought you were all dead. But you were taking care of him, weren't you? Somehow you found a way. I'm not gonna lie. I never thought you had it in you. We took care of each other. We all had each other's backs. You've changed, brother. It took the end of the world. But you finally grew up. This is where they're treating Kate. Don't get comfortable. We're not staying long. Hey! Hey, kid. Got everything you need? Uh, yeah. This place is like a resort. Check it out, Javi! Noodles in a cup! We need to get you some real food. Stat, turn you into a soldier. <laughs> Javi, I'm glad you're okay. <laughs> get off hey, me. Up, huh? <laughs> you know me. I'm always okay. It's good to have you back. Look at this family. Look at my wife. Isn't she the most beautiful woman alive? Come on. With the lights off, you could mistake me for a walker. A damn fine walker. I'm pretty sure you have to say that. Doesn't make it not true. Ah! 
What, you okay? Oh, my... Shit. I'll get the doc. I'm fine. I just needed to talk to you, alone. I'm scared, Javi, more than I was the whole time on the road. Even when I thought I was going to die, everything inside me screams to get away from here. These people are killers. And David? Well, what about Gabe? He seems pretty happy to see his dad. Gabe will do what we say. We've been taking care of him. It's always been you and me on the road, Javi. That's how we've made it this far. Please, promise me we'll go back to that. The first chance we get. This place. It's a cage. We can't let ourselves get locked in. I hear you, Kate. But we can't just turn our backs on this place. On my brother. Javi. We have to try to make it work. I used to say that about my fucked up marriage. Guess it still applies. Whatever. Just, please. Please don't leave me alone for too long. Feeling better? How you doing, sweetheart? David reported some pain. It's less now. Strange how it just comes and goes. Doesn't seem normal. She was rambling a bit. Yeah, I, I think she's delirious. Well, she seems cogent now. But it's nothing to be alarmed about. Pain often comes in waves with abdominal wounds. <laughs> I'll give you something to take the edge off, in case it comes back. Truly superlative work. I thought I'd have to operate, but all she needed was IV fluids and some antibiotics. How did you find someone with skills like these? A wound like this kills 9 out of 10. Whoever did this really knows their stuff. That would be Eleanor. One of my friends you threw in quarantine. Well, she's no use to anyone there. We should let her out. I'll vouch for her. Agreed. I'll have Ava bring her here. I want to meet this Eleanor. I'm sure she'll be an asset to our community. The rest of those guys can contribute. If that's what it takes to get free. They're all pretty handy in a fight. That's why they're all under guard. Javi and I have to go meet some people now. See if we can't prove he's worth a damn. We're gonna take real good care of you. Okay? Send my apologies, David. I won't be able to make it. Feeling okay? Fine. I just want to keep an eye on my patient. The others know my vote is with you. Come on. Remember what I said. When we meet these guys, keep what happened to Mariana to yourself. Badger is one of my guys. And I will handle him. It may look pretty, but it's all sugars. There's no substance. It tastes pretty, Clint. That's all that matters. Ah, the brother. Javi, meet the guys. Clint runs food production. The crops you saw, that's him and his people. Jones, our bridge to the outside world. She handles contact with other settlements. Pleased to meet you, Javi. I trust you've been treated well. I hope you haven't been handled too roughly. Some of our people left their courtesy with their old lives. <laughs> oh yeah, the cell you threw me in was totally five-star. I'm sorry about that. <laughs> we have to be careful. I'm sure you can understand. <laughs> we were just about to eat. Clint was trying to convince me of the essential superiority of his cream spinach over my magnificent Black Forest Gateau. It's no contest. The spinach has real nutritional value. Javi. Take a look at that table. You tell me what you'd rather put in your belly. Spinach from Clint's garden? Or a baked delicacy by yours truly? 
Everything looks so good, I, I want it all. So polite, David. You sure he's your brother? Can't trust a diplomat. Always saying one thing and thinking another. Please, make yourself comfortable. We value straight talk here, so please, forgive me if I seem direct. We're usually pretty strict about who we open our doors to. Your brother's word counts for a lot. Is that so? The three of us, and Dr. Lingard, make all the decisions here, so, yeah. People who choose to stay with us, they have to deal with us bossing them around. Not saying you wouldn't, but it can be an adjustment. Especially for the more independent-minded. There's no structure out there now. People get used to doing as they please. No offense, but what qualifies you to lead? Testing us already? Just curious who's leading the troops into battle. Everything you see, we built ourselves. If that's not an endorsement, I don't know what is. When Joan and I met your brother, he was trying his hand at fruit. Fruit? We found him slowly murdering an orchard on the Shenandoah River. Hotty fucking huh? I helped him bring it back to life. We had a good run there. For as long as it lasted. What happened? What always happens. We trusted the wrong damn people. That's what led us to start this. Wondering what this fine piece of body art is all about? It's our litmus test for loyalty. That looks pretty intense. Doesn't it hurt? It's burned into your flesh. Of course it fucking hurts. It's a sign of commitment, not a Buddhist symbol from your year abroad. It was a crude answer to a difficult problem, and it hasn't always worked. Please understand. We had a terrible winter just after we moved here. We... we lost a great deal. Loved ones who left holes in our lives. Protecting my people from that kind of pain, that's what keeps me awake at night. It turned me into a perpetual night owl. I know it's a lot to ask. I know how you feel. Seeing the people I care about suffer, it, it's a terrible feeling. I just want to shield them from it all. It's a noble aim. One worth fighting for. Max? What are you doing here? I sent for him. Since when does he answer to you? From what I hear, he's well acquainted with your brother. They exchanged a few bullets outside our walls. Is that right? Is there bad blood between you and Max? Nothing that can't be worked out. I want to hear that from Javi. If I were you, I'd get him away from me before I do something I regret. Javi, be cool. Try it and see what happens, boy. I was willing to let bygones be. Max, how did this start? Don't look at him. You have an obligation to tell the truth. We caught him siphoning gas from one of our vehicles. Max. Sorry, David. I know he's family, but your brother's a thief. Is it true? Answer her. Did you steal gas from us? We were on the run from a herd. We just needed a single can. Everyone needs gas, asshole. If you just asked, we'd have given it to you. That... that's not all. Rufus said Clementine ran his truck off the road just to break him free. We had real problems with her in the past. You can always judge a man by the company he keeps. Running with that girl don't look good. I would say not. Well, let's judge you then. You got some colorful friends. So what if Javi met up with Clementine? It doesn't mean anything. We kicked her out for a reason, David. Now the two of them are thick as thieves. This is who you're asking us to vouch for, David? Seriously? You know we can't just open our doors to bandits. We're trying to build something different here. Something resembling civilization. Everything I did out there was to protect my people. That's more than I can say for you. I'm not sure what you mean. Javi? You have something to say? One of your people. Some asshole called Badger. He put a bullet in a little girl. My niece. David's daughter. What? Damn it, Javi, I told you I'd handle it. No, David. This cousin fucking dirtbag has the balls to accuse me. He and Badger destroyed an entire town. That's enough. No. We need to hear this. 
Go on, Javi. Sounds like you've got more to get off your chest. They used tear gas. There was nothing left of Prescott when they were done. Badger did that. Not me. You were right there next to him. I tried to get him to stop, I swear. David, we warned you about getting your soldiers in line. We don't know all the facts. We know enough. She's right, David. You've lost control. I want them gone. All of them. Take Javi and everyone in the quarantine to the gate. Send them out with enough weapons to defend themselves, but no more. Look, we can't fight this. Not now. Kate and Gabe will be safe here, your doctor friend too. But the rest of you, you're gonna have to do what they say. I'm sorry. It's out of my hands. I can't leave Kate and Gabe alone. They won't be alone. I'll be here to take care of them. I can't help you now, but maybe I can down the road. Just stay alive, okay? Oh, what the fuck? We didn't do anything. I might do something here in a minute. David packed this. He did. They said- Start walking. What about Eleanor? Walk. Eat shit. Answer my fucking question. God damn it, Harvey! Let go of me! This isn't her fault, Trip. You're mad at the wrong person. Do not fuck this up. There's a settlement a few miles west of here. Don't come back. Get with the program, he says. We trusted you. What the hell, man? Everything was going okay. At first. I don't know what happened back there. Yeah, well, I got a pretty good idea what's gonna happen out here. Let's just see what they gave us. Knowing them, it's probably a butter knife and a stick of gum. They could have just shot us. More than once. Oh, how fucking neighborly. What's that? It looks like a map. I doubt they give one to everyone. Ava did say David packed the bag. Why the hell is it tied to a baseball bat? David's sense of humor was always poorly timed. Looks like they're expanding. Some of these areas are marked clear. Okay. There's Richmond. That helps. But we can't go back there. Knowing where it is lets us know where we are. I'm pretty sure David wants us to go there. And if this is us here, then I think we can head along this path. Just gotta head north. And to find north... We need to find the North Star. That's it. We need to go this way. What else is in there? Not a whole lot. Flashlight. Not enough weapons. No food. Deal with it. Take it. 
please, take it. Call it an apology. That man back there in the tunnel, that wasn't me. Take the gun. Conrad, don't let the past get in the way of common sense. The gun is yours, Conrad. I can handle myself. Nobody fires a single shot unless you are deep fucking fried. You hear me? We don't want to attract whatever the hell's out there. I gotta tell you, man, I thought you and Kate were, you know. I mean, I saw you kiss her in the junkyard, and uh, I ain't judging, mind you, I'm just curious. What's the story? Ain't my business, I know, but what have we got to lose out here? I... Hey. Man, it's all right. Go for it. I do have feelings for her. Maybe I shouldn't, but that doesn't just make him go away. Uh, no harm in saying it. Hell, only real harms in not saying it when you should. It's always a mess, ain't it? What's that? Who you love, who loves you. If they're one and the same or otherwise. You know what I mean? <laughs> Just when you think you got everything figured out, boom, heart goes ass over tea kettle. And you're right, goddamn mess. And it never quite washes out. Eleanor and I, we were something at some point, but nothing now. I respect her wishes. I really do. I just wish my heart respected mine. Jesus got his eye on something. What you got for us, man? Listen. Tell me that isn't what I think it is. About a quarter mile out. Heading the same way we are. Well, we could hit walkers any second. We better scoot. Walkers. Get ready. They're near. Alive, people. I got Come on, man, move your ass. You want a piece of this? Careful with this. Where even now? I'm 
This is a bad idea. We're following David's map right into a herd. For all we know, he's trying to get rid of us. Come on, Clem. He's my brother. You can't trust him, Javi. I learned that the hard way. I never wanted to need people again, but I had nowhere else to go. The New Frontier gave me this and made me one of them. They promised they'd help him. That turned out to be a lie. Clem. Dr. Lingard, what's the matter with you? I'm... I'm fine. Clem, please don't. The vancomycin... That's the last of it. It'll be wasted on AJ. I told you. It could save someone's life if used right. You don't know that for sure. Sadly, I do. It's my curse. Your curse? Knowing when someone's gonna die. I'm sorry, Clem. I tried everything. I... I really did. This will help him get better. Nothing can help your boy now. Clem, put the drugs back before anyone finds out you took them. You know what they do to thieves here. I have to try. you to be brave for me now, okay? Shh, shh, see? It's not so bad. <laughs> AJ, shh. What the hell is this? I told her it was a bad idea. Are you fucking high again? Pull yourself together before the others see you. Deal with the damn kid. What the fuck were you thinking? You were told those drugs couldn't help him. How could you be so stupid? Did you think I would just give up on him? AJ is everything to me, David. I'd do anything to keep him alive. Except there's nothing left to do. That waste? That'll cost someone's life down the road. Someone in this camp. Someone who contributes to our survival. Come on, David. She was just trying to help her kid. We helped enough! We should have left him out in the woods a week ago! But look! It's helping! 
It doesn't work that way, Clem. You bought him a peaceful moment. <laughs> Nothing more. I wish I could tell you it would save him. But that's the reality. Then it was worth it. I'd do it again in a heartbeat. Without a goddamn thought for anyone else. We opened our arms to you. Made you one of us. This is how you repay us? By stealing? By putting yourself before the group? You're done here. You broke our rules, Clem. Violated our trust. There's no place for you in the New Frontier. This was about his survival. So don't you dare judge me. It's always about survival. We have a better chance of it with you gone. Maybe we should give her another chance. Don't fight me on this, Paul. You know what Joan would say if she were here. I'm sorry, Clem. You brought this on yourself. Come on, AJ. We don't need this place anyway. Uh-uh. He stays. Can't take him with you. That ship has sailed. I'm not leaving without him. AJ can't travel. All we can do now is make him comfortable. I'm not leaving without him. Let him go, Clem. He'll only drag you down out there. It's what's best for both of you. No! You monsters! What about this? What was it all for? Don't forget, I'm one of you. Not anymore. Let her say goodbye. We owe her that much, at least. Fine. You heard her. Say what you need to say, then you go. Please don't make me regret this. Be strong, Paul. Be strong for me. Let's go. This is what David circled on the map. Our smelly friends are back. Then push against this, it might give. We gotta find a way in. Here they come. I can. Uh, fuck! I can raise it a little, but I don't know, something's wrong with it. Jammed or some shit. Maybe we can force it open. We're gonna have to. Well, there's a car. With no wheels. Shit! God damn it!
That's it. We won't go any higher. Everyone get in! Close. You can say that again. Hey, I'm here! David! Don't you dare let that fucking baby killer in! <gasps> Don't make me do this! Clem. Don't do it, Javi! I thought you were a good man. We need to barricade the door. Did you let him turn? Tell me! Now! Answer her question. Now. We didn't have to worry about that. What the hell does that mean? He lived, Clem. He lived. But how? He was dying. Clem said so. AJ bounced back. He was stronger than we thought. It was... a miracle. You're lying. I don't know, Clem. I don't think he'd lie about this. You don't know him like I do. Clementine, please, I'm telling the truth. Where? Where is AJ now? I don't know for sure. But he's in Richmond? Dr. Lingard took care of the boy. He'll know how to find him. Then I'm going back. None of us are going anywhere until the walker's clear. What's your plan, David? We used to store vehicle up this way. Provisions. I came to get you set up. And? And say goodbye. I don't want you to worry about Kate and Gabe. I'll take care of my family from now on. They'll be safe with me. You could at least say goodbye back. Shit! Board it up. We need something to buffer. Something heavy. There! Help me! Board it up. We need something to buffer. Something heavy. There. Help me. Wait a half second. Where'd you find this? Over there. Show me.
hell is all this? These could come in handy. Don't want to just take them, but... I might be going crazy, but... I think these came from Prescott. That's Phantom Punch. I don't understand how all this got here. Like you don't know. Hey, none of this stuff was here before. I don't have a damn thing to do with it. We've only ever kept a few basic supplies here for scouts, for emergencies. Your people looted this stuff from Prescott, David. Come on, we can't know that. Who else knew about this place? Your outfit is the only one that gutted my town. This is bigger than just Prescott. There's spoils from other towns here, too. Towns I heard got raided a while back. There, there's stuff here from the kingdom. Who the fuck are you? Wouldn't be in this mess if you hadn't gone all trigger happy on David's family. Take cover. Fuck him. I'd do that little bitch again just to see her head pop. You sure as hell are stupid, ain't you? You only just realizing that now? I told you. Joan is on the warpath. Last thing we need is people getting wind of all this stuff. Look at all this shit. We're freaking rolling in it. I'll give you that. Just glad we found some more smokes. That shit is the new gold. And now we get to see your head pop, you piece of shit. David! I thought better of you, Max. I really did. David, come on, man. We're a unit. There's no need for... <laughs> Stop him! He's getting away! Go! Get Badger! Shove that gas can down your throat and lit you up like a candle. But this'll do. took my goddamn guts out. Um, um, fuck. This is for Mariana. She was a sweet little girl, just minding her own business. <laughs> Not anymore. Fuck her, and fuck you too. Easy, Conrad. 
He's already down. Remember my woman? Francine? You! You snuffed her out like she was nothing. <coughs> she was... nothing. He's finished. Get it over with. Come on. What are you waiting for? We've got to move. No point drawing it out. Conrad? What? Ain't got the guts to kill another man. No. You're not a man. You're nothing. who we are. You betrayed Richmond. Come on, David. This is Richmond. What's that supposed to mean? What's that supposed to mean? I ain't got nothing to say. Start talking, or I promise you, you're gonna scream. Okay, okay, take it easy. I'm waiting. Come on, man. It wasn't like we were doing this by ourselves. Joe was in on it. We did it on her orders. She... She said we needed it to survive. I wanted to let you in, but she told me you'd never go for it. I'm... I'm sorry. It is too late for sorry, you backstabbing shitbag. Please, don't kill me. I'll help you. I'll, I'll tell everyone in Richmond about this. I'll help you get back inside. Expose her to the others. Maybe he'll be useful. Thank you. Thank you. I needed that. Where's Lonnie? He gave us the slip. Hightailed it back towards Richmond. Son of a bitch. If he warns Joan... Wasn't there one more? Won't be hurting anyone else. My people need to know about what we found here. What about your missing friends? I'm not holding out much hope. Don't have time to keep looking. They'd want me to get home and warn them. So that's what I'm gonna do. Sooner the better. You're a good guy, Jesus. That's rare. I could say the same about you. I won't forget about you. You have my word. It's a shitstorm out there, man. I don't see how you're gonna make it. One step at a time. We need to get back to Richmond fast. I have loved ones in there. We both do. We all do. I gotta break Eleanor out of there. Once she's safe, I... I'm gonna tell her how I feel. Hey, if the mess never washes out, might as well get neck deep. We're gonna need allies in Richmond. Lingard and Clint, they're our best bet. If I can get to them before Joan does, maybe we have a chance. I know I was ready to say goodbye before, but I can't do this without you. Can I count on you? I won't be able to pull this off myself. Of course, David. You're my brother. I never forgot that. Even if you did. I'm glad to hear that, Javi. You and I... We should talk. When this is done. If Lonnie raises the alarm, they'll be waiting for us at the gates. There's a way in round back that'll get us around any sentries. We can take Badger's truck. I doubt he'll mind. Come on, we gotta get on the move. 
Hertz closing in. Thinking this will go a lot better if we split up. A group this big can't exactly sneak around, particularly if they're expecting us. Eleanor's in there somewhere. I'm going after her. Then I'm coming with you. Lingard brought her to the clinic. That's your best bet. Javi, that's where you'll go to get Kate and Gabe. Then bring them to my house. It's the one with the raven on the hitching post. We'll all meet up there. After I pay a little visit to Joan, Stay out of sight. They'll be keeping an eye out for us. As soon as I can get Kate and Gabe, we'll see you back at the house. Roger that. I'll scout ahead. What about you, Clem? I'm pretty sure I've still got some friends in the New Frontier. If they know where AJ's being held, they'll tell me. As soon as I find him, taking that truck and getting the hell out of here. Well, you are owed a vehicle. Keep an eye on David. He may be playing nice, but I'd still watch your back. Give me a little credit, Clem. I can handle David. I really hope you're right. But you're no dummy. Your instincts have been right most of the time. I know you'll make the right call. See you when I see you. David said to hang a ride up at that corner. Seems clear so far. Let's move. You know Javi Garcia? Used to play shortstop for Baltimore. That Javier Garcia? That's who we're looking for? Yeah. That Javier Garcia. Anyway, sounds like some paranoid horse shit. Guy's a fucking ball player. There's the medical that center. Gonna go ninja his way back in here and stir up trouble. We go yeah, in, we get L, we get Kate and Gabe, we get out. Right. Not that easy, man. We've seen the Maykays before, and they ain't afraid to use them. All right, let's hang out here for a while. Smoke break. Damn it. We need a distraction. How's your throwing arm? What the hell was that? Let's check it out. You go first. Still got it. You guys find out. Tell her we're moving Kate. Sounds good. We'll meet you here. Super worried. Hey, buddy. I'm fine. I'm just fine. They said you guys were denied entry. It's true. We're on borrowed time. The people who run this place, they're ruthless. We have to move. Where's my dad? Is he coming? 
Don't worry, buddy. We're gonna go meet up with him. Excuse me? David has a house in town. He thinks we'll be okay there. Then let's go! Wait, Javi? While you were gone, this woman, Joan, came by. I felt like she was sizing me up. It was creepy. She implied David was in trouble. Like he was no longer in charge. She kept saying Gabe and I didn't need to worry, but it only made me worry more. I got a bad feeling from her. She's a scary lady. But don't worry. David's gonna handle her. He knows what to do. Scary how? The people who shot you? Answer to her. She ordered raids on other settlements. We found all this stuff from Prescott. She was behind Prescott? David's rounding up allies to confront her right now. Javi, I know you wanted to try it here, but this isn't our fight. We already lost Mari because of these people. Now, the whole place is about to become a war zone. It's David's fight, Kate. And we're in it with him. He needs our help. Kate, come You're on. You're not hearing me. This is not our problem. What's going on? Tripp said we had to move to David's house. We're not doing that. We're getting the fuck out of Richmond before it's too late. Getting out? You shouldn't even be sitting up. What? W what about my dad? We can't just leave him. Gabe, we don't even know who he is anymore. We have to get away before he gets us all killed. But he, he won't know where we are. Again! We're gonna go to David's house. Javi! It's the best bet we got. It's all we got. I've got a gun in the room they gave me. Sounds like we might need it. I'll come with you. We'll catch up with you guys. Sounds good. Don't. I didn't see Clem with you guys. Is she okay? I know, I know, she's tough, but I don't know. It'd be nice to hear she's all right. If we run into her, she could really use a friend right now. Yeah, me too. We need to go, okay? Okay. You know this is what David lives for, right? What? A brawl. I only ever saw him truly happy when he was talking about being at war. The world going to shit? I guarantee. That was the best day of his life. No one lives for war. I'm sure it's not like that. You weren't there, Javi. Not like I was. Took your damn time. Come on, we have to hurry. Wait a second. David told us to come here. He's talking to the others now. Trust me, shit's about to fly. He's gonna need our help. We gotta get on the move. He's waiting for us. There's no more time to lose. Get them to safety first. Then we can go. This is the best way to protect them. They'll be safe here, don't worry. I'll come back for you. Both of you. You better. I don't like your tone, David. If this is about your brother... Don't pretend like you don't know what this is about. You've got a lot to answer for. Me? You must be joking. Javi! Kate and Gabe? Safe. 
I knew I could count on you, brother. We're gonna fix this, together. Of course. Kate and Gabe are safe. I got your back. Thank you. It means a lot that you do. What's going on here? We're just getting started. You smuggled your brother into Richmond despite what we agreed. Clearly, you have no respect for any of us. This is serious, David. You know we can't let this go. You don't deserve respect. Not after the things you've done. What things? What's this all about? She's been ordering raids on peaceful communities, sending your men to murder and loot. Raiding? Joan, is this true? <laughs> He's pointing the finger at everyone. First Badger, now me. That's a serious charge. You come in swinging, you better have proof. Here's our proof. This lowlife was part of the raids. I... Well, Max, what do you have to say? We had a deal, Max. Your life for the truth. I didn't forget. Then what are you waiting for? Me, Badger, and Lonnie, we ran the ops. Off Jones' orders. God damn it, Max. I'm washing my hands of this, man. Joan. How could you? The real question is, how could I not? What would happen to us without your fertilizer, Clint? Or your pills, Paul? Do you think our community would survive? I did what I had to, to ensure that we would. It wasn't easy. You really think you could justify this? I know I can. All of you remember the winter. How much we lost. Friends. Lovers. Children. I made a promise I would never let that happen again. The raids were just to keep us going till Richmond reached sustainability. We're so close. So close to our dream. Do we really want to risk it all by fighting amongst ourselves? We should all be on the same side of this, David. On Richmond's side. Surely you can see that. You people make me sick. We lost Mariana to those raids. How many others lost their kids too? I'm sorry, David. It breaks my heart about your child. It's... It's something I'm going to have to live with. Take them! What the hell? Put them in a cell until I can figure out what to do with them. Don't you fucking touch me! That's an order! They don't take orders from you anymore, David. You're done here. You put yourself before the group. I hope you choke on your fucking cake. It looked like shit, by the way. Paul, come on! I'm sorry. My hands are tied. This is not over, Joe. I have friends here. Allies. 